Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel Go Dynamic IT. Have you ever found yourself in a situation where your Wi-Fi adapter suddenly stops working and you are left without internet on your laptop or other devices? But don't worry, in this video, I am going to show you a simple and effective solution sharing your internet over Bluetooth and it's super easy to set it up. So let's dive right into the video and share your internet on Windows 10, Windows 11 and mobile phone okay so first thing first what we will do is we'll set up our mobile phone so let me bring my mobile phone here okay you can see here this is my mobile phone and this is the samsung uh, mobile phone and inside the samsung mobile phone what we have to do is first we have to go to our bluetooth so we have to go to bluetooth and we have to start our scanning first so you can see my mobile is in a scanning mode and now we have to go to our windows 10 machine so this is the windows 10 machine and then i'll show you in the windows 11 also subsequently right so let's go and type in the search button type bluetooth so once you see this bluetooth here um you can see you can see this bluetooth and other device and i say that add bluetooth or other devices just click over here and it says that which what do you want to scan so i want to scan for the bluetooth devices and it says that it's going in a scanning mode and it should show us our mobile phone that is samsung and here we go you can see this samsung m34 5g here just click on this okay so as you can see here the uh, mobile phone is showing okay as you can see here this device is showing you this galaxy m34 5g here so we have to select this device and you can see double click on that and it says that connecting and you can see on the both of your mobile phone and your um, pc it's showing the same number right so on first click on the mobile phone it says that pair and once you click on the pair on the pc also you have to select the connect and you can see this device is ready to go and you see this samsung click on the done here and now you can say this is paired right so once it paired let me show you one more thing here so i do not have a internet on this pc so how do i prove it let's go to cmd and ping this google 8.8.8.8 enter and you can see this is the general failure here and uh, let me take you to the browser also so let's go to incong mode and let's open the google google.com and you can see here this says that cannot reach the ip address fine so let's go to our control panel here inside the control panel we have to go to you can see here hardware and sound inside the hardware and sound we say device and printer click here and inside that you can see the galaxy m34 5g right click on it and once you right click on it it says that connect using so you have a two option direct access or access point direct connections and access point so click on access point and the moment you click on the access point you can see this says that successfully connected and once you've done that now the second step you have to go back to your mobile phone again and click on the connections inside the connections you have to go to you can see mobile hotspot and tethering so select here and you have to select the mobile bluetooth tethering so select that bluetooth tethering and once you select that you can see this icon get changed here okay we have changed this bluetooth tethering and then again we have to go to this uh, icon here m4 30 34 and you have to connect and right click on the device and say the access point mode is at connection successfully and the moment you do that you can see this network icon has been changed now so let's go back to our ping and try to ping this 8.8.8 .8 see if that works okay you can see this is the ping request so we have a three ping request here now let's go to this google.com and refresh this page and voila you can see here we have a internet access on this windows machine so let's say that's apple and see if it's showing you some search about this apple or not okay you can see this it is showing in the search option or the app this is about your accessing the internet over windows 10 machine with the help of bluetooth right now let's go back to windows 11 machine let me show you how you can do that on the windows 11 machine as now you don't have to do anything in the mobile phone let's go back to your windows okay so as you can see this is my windows 11 machine and inside the search again you have to type this bluetooth click on the bluetooth another option and here it says that add device click here and the similar way you have to select the bluetooth to search it and you can see that it's search my mobile phone m34 5g click here and it's trying to connect that connecting and you can see here on the both my uh, it's asking about the pin on my mobile phone right so um, on the windows 10 it was just pair but here it's asking for, for it's uh, windows 11 is more secure so it's asking for the pin also so let's key in our pin here four five 
double three six two one four and pair and you can see this is connected done and let me show you one more thing here this pc also doesn't have a internet so let me ping that cmd and ping 8.8.8.8 you can see this is the general failure and uh, let me open the browser here what browser i have okay i have edge let's go to edge here this is the default page let me go google.com and you can see you are not connected right now again we have to go back to the same menu here you can see uh, it, show, it will show us this mobile phone you can see the galaxy m34 5g is connected you see the three dots here click here and you can see join personal area network pan click on that so that how you want to connect it you want to connect with the access point or direct connection so i would like to connect as a access point so click here connect it says that connection successful okay and now you can see this network icon has been changed let's go back to our ping first and ping it and here you can see i have a ping reply coming from the google just minimize this now let's go back to our browser here and refresh it okay so as you can see here we have a google uh, working on our windows 11 machine right and let's try something here let's say mac here press enter and let's say if shows something about this mac or not so okay you can see here we have a result for the mac also so that means we have internet connection and we can search the keywords right now let me show you the third option so let me connect my other mobile phone also so let me let me bring my mob other mobile phone here and uh, so you can see here this is my another mobile phone this is also an android phone but this applicable on any uh, mobile phone like your android your apple right so as you can see this is my now you have to go to the bluetooth inside the bluetooth we have to search appear a new device and let's see if that search my mobile phone or not trying search if not what we have to do is maybe your bluetooth scanning has got a stop so you have to go to the bluetooth again and it will start the scan you can see this galaxy m34 5g click here and should allow us to option a pair option you can see here both my device is giving the pair option click on the pair and here also click on the pair and you can see this is paired and do one more thing here uh, let me disconnect this uh, mobile internet you can see i have disabled this mobile internet on this phone done and i do not have a wi-fi connected and i have only i only have a bluetooth connected on this device right so now let's go to our browser here and uh, let me close thing tab what do you have to do just time to speed test let's see if that is speed test speed test work here and you can see here I have a speed test of the, on this mobile phone also. So technically, you know, let me show you a very interesting thing here. I'm very excited to show you to you. So if I go to the Bluetooth on my mobile force one, you can see I have a three devices connected here. Two laptops. One is my Windows 10. Another one is Windows 11. And third one is mobile phone. So all my three devices are connected over the Bluetooth and I'm able to access the internet. Isn't it is interesting the stuff, right? So this is really, this will be very useful when you're, um, I mean, my intention is not to connect all the three devices, but what, uh, just to show you that you can connect your, how to connect on the Windows 10, Windows 11 and your any other mobile phone. So I think uh, we have covered this agenda for today's video. And if you have any questions, query or any feedback related to this video, please do let me know in the comment box so thank you very much for watching the video see you in the next one